So do me a favor and search for um, Tucson Jazz Cooperative in the in the graph search and see if it comes up. I just created the group. Tucson. Actually, a page. It's a page rather than a group. Tucson. Uh, I think I called it jazz. Um, jazz. Cooperative. Like co-op. I deliberately picked it. I picked a different. So I might have to send you that stream. Um, uh, do you want? Do you want to just um, for me to stop my stream and then we can find it and I send it to you or, or. Uh, but, but, but this is just me understanding how this technology. Right. Exactly. I'm in the same boat. Right, I've been live streaming the whole time on a different channel. Uh, maybe because it's so new that it hasn't been published yet. Um, so, it, it, have you tried searching for my name to see if it comes up? If you search for my name, it should say Glenn Dunn Gross. Glenn Dunn. Glenn Dunn. Right. And then if, maybe. Um, I don't know if it's possible for you to pick up the stream from there or if I have to send it to you. It's going to be the stream URL, the same thing that I pasted. You know what? I can probably paste it into a text to you. Want me to do that now? An email? Yeah, where, what would I do? Uh, you would click on it and you would be able to see yourself as one of the two cameras that's now live streaming because we're doing a loop a loop on it. So you're... you know Right. So you're under the stars, Gross, yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. <laughs> uh, uh, is there anywhere where it shows you my pages? Yeah. How about pa yeah? That was what I just did earlier. But I think if you uh, if you could find a, I just created this page, so maybe it's uh maybe it's not all the way published, or it just hasn't percolated through uh, Facebook's uh, databases yet. Um, but I can send you this. I can either. Um, you know what? Let me see if I can get it to you through an email. Okay, you want to hold on for a second and I'll try that? Sure. Okay, so I'm just going to put it in the background now. And uh, I think I can just share it. Let's see. I am live, so maybe I can share this. Share it to your timeline. Oh, you know what? I maybe, I don't know. I got a go live button here. Maybe I'm not actually live. It's I, the LBS thinks I'm live, but maybe I'm not. Um, I want to try this for a second. I'm going to try um, test live stream at, with, okay, um, okay, this test stream is, let's see, whoops, I dropped my mouse, hold on, okay, I'm typing um, this live stream is with is is with Michael Grigsby. Hey, so you're gonna get a notice that you were tagged. Now I'm gonna click go live. Now I clicked go live within the page, and I think it's gonna work, but I don't know for sure. Um, Where would I get that? I think you I think you'd have to. Okay, now can you um can you go to to on um another window on your computer and load Facebook? Just uh tab. Hey, no, the same one. Just go to your uh, messages, announcements, or, or uh, and it should say Glenn tagged you in a post. Either should work, maybe FaceTime better. This is the last one. Okay, so um, do you see I have a little bell at the top of Facebook and your main page. Um, yeah. Click on the little bell. Notifications. Yeah. Do you see um, anything from no. me at all? Okay, well, I'm going to try another thing. I'm going to try tagging you as a comment. Hold on. Okay, I just I just ta uh, posted you as a as a, a a comment. Did it show up? Glenn Gross posted in quarantine records. Oh, is that where we are? All right. You in a yes. Yeah, click on that and see what comes up. Uh, <laughs> yes, I see you live, and I, I don't think that that's. 
So there's going to be a lag delay. I don't know how much. Five minutes, 30 seconds, uh, two minutes, 10 minutes. Um, is it working at all? Yes, I, I, there's, I can hear, I, I'm not hearing it on the computer. I'm hearing it ambiently through the headset here. Oh, isn't that funny? <laughs> well, I, I see, I see you. Right. Right. And now, I, now I'm seeing the, the, the lag time of me telling you what I just said. Right, right. So, so this is so we're we're in a live stream with two cameras, and uh, I started the stream, and your audio is only coming through my phone, which means people probably can't hear it very well in the stream. But if you um, if if we just hook my phone up to a speaker, then this is a solution where we're not going to have a lag between us because we'll be able to hear both of us at the same time. I think. Uh, wow, this is really over. This is heating up my computer. Do you want to? You want to call it a success and come back later and do some more? Just invest. Yeah, okay, this, this is. We've made a lot of progress. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, when you hook up camera two, you're gonna have a lot of fun playing gigs with yourself and stuff like that. <laughs> you know, play a, play the melody in one camera and, and then save that as a file. Set that up as a source within OBS, and then you'll be able to play along with your own bass line. Uh, at a different time, do multi multi track video, and I, and then you can stream it later or as you're doing it. Uh, but we're doing the live thing now, and this is just you know to explore the technology. We haven't played anything together yet. You want to play one more thing before we sign off? Did you see that Jesse Kaiser just commented? Oh, I don't know. I'm not watching my. I'm looking at my OBS screen. If you don't want to lag, look at OBS screen instead of looking at Facebook. Bring OBS back. And and look at the OBS screen while you uh, while you play. Are, are you getting it? I'm only seeing me on the OBS. Yeah, that's because there's only one camera in your OBS. That's why. But at least you won't get a lag. Um, yeah. So want to go ahead and play a little bit? Just maybe one quick blues. Okay. So this is Michael Grigsby and I. Okay, and we're we're about ready to go live. How about uh, an F? Okay. Okay, let's do a little uh, straight no chaser. Ready? Uh, no. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that would help, wouldn't it? It would help to have a bass. <laughs> yeah, this is a uh, musicians. Uh, we're always creative people, but sometimes we attempt things that aren't always sound or wise. But it's because we're exploring new technology and how to apply it. So we're about to apply this. And this is a this is the decentralized jam where we're connected through um, Apple's FaceTime, but we're streaming through um, uh, uh, Facebook. So Face FaceTime and Facebook are both playing a role in this. And we'll see what we get, shall we? So how about okay, one, two, a one, two, three. <laughs>
Okay, we did it. That that is our that is our proof of a concept right there. That's our proof of concept. You know, we uh we did a live stream. We're not how how many miles apart are we? About fifty miles apart. Okay, so so if if the if the timing isn't right, um, ladies and gentlemen, we can blame it on the fact that we're fifty miles apart. So it takes the light a little while to get <laughs> get from where Michael is. Michael's in Tucson, right? North Tucson. Yeah, I'm in Green Valley, about 40 miles south. So this was a jam that covered a 40 mile uh, radius or 40 mile diameter, whatever. But anyway, we proved that the, the concept, uh, at least you know, is worth investigating. And I know we can improve it once I find my stupid little adapter for my phone so I can put it through some speakers. You know, I got I need to fix that uh, sound thing because I don't think they're going to be able to hear you very well in this setup. But anyway, I think that was a it was a worthy effort, and we might want to go ahead and just uh, sign off at this point and look at the stream and see how ridiculous it is or how close did we come to accomplishing something significant. And as the directors that I worked with would say, cut. cut. <laughs> and on that note, I'm going to end my live stream right now. So I'm going to click stop streaming. Okay, okay I, it says stopping stream. Now I'm going to click stop recording.